you're welcome to my channel uh, we are handling our coach unit called uganda nikon and we are going to be handling topic two topic two of this course unit which is called macroeconomic indicators in our previous videos we managed handling topic one which was the introduction so in this video we are going to be handling macroeconomic indicators which is topic two of this course unit yeah so the macro in macroeconomic indicators are the ones we shall first talk about Ma macroeconomic indicators mainly look at inflation analysis of inflation inflation rate exchange rate the gdp growth rate unemployment rate interest rate and credit conditions in uganda so the, the, those are the major macroeconomic indicators that we are going to look at the inflation rate exchange rate gdp growth rate unemployment rate and interest rate and credit conditions in uganda and these va variables should be in a state of equilibrium to attain macroeconomic stability yeah they they they, they should be in a state of equilibrium like in an equal stage or in a favorable position yeah, in order for a, a state to attain its macroeconomic stability. So Uganda has four macroeconomic objectives. Uganda has macroeconomic objectives. Yeah. So we have Uganda's four macroeconomic objectives. The first one is real economic growth rate of at least 6% per annum. So you, you, Uganda aims at getting real economic growth rate of at least 6% per annum. Then inflation rate within single digits, target is 5%. They want an interest rate with a single digit, for example, 5%. Then maintain reserves equivalent to 4.5 months of inputs. And lastly, the stable and competitive real exchange rate. So those are the four macroeconomic objectives of Uganda. Yeah. They are four. And then plus the plus the what plus the macroeconomic indicators as we saw them. Yeah, they are six: inflation rate, exchange rate, GDP, and employment, interest, then credit conditions, and then the four objectives. So this has been the introduction. Thanks for watching.